What's up my dudes, Orin as well, and welcome to Pokemon Adventure Red Chapter, a uh, Pokemon fan game, which is a ROM hack that follows the story of uh, the Pokemon manga, where Red is the hero. I actually don't know anything about the manga, despite having played uh, almost all of the p main series games. I know nothing about the manga, so I'm excited to uh, find out about the story of this, so let's dive into it. Ah, uh, Charizard sounds still there. The one meter, ah, blah, 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 that's boring. Oh, oh shit, she's dead. Wicked woman, escaping alone is going to use up all my strength, but I don't intend to leave empty-handed. Dude, is she alright? Like, what's wrong with her? Young boy, don't tell me. You want Deoxys? Wait, what? Deoxys is in this game? That's right. Deoxys Entity 2 is a Pokemon of incredible strength. How can I just let it go free so easily? Oh, alright, she's with the evil team in this game, probably. Also, Silver is here from Gen 2. That's surprising. It wasn't easy for Deoxys to regain its freedom. We won't let you retake it. What's going on? Ah! 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 Lots of grunting. Ugh! Well, well. <laughs> How am I going to do this laugh? <laughs> ah, man. I kind of sound like a witch. It seems like something unexpected happened when the attack intended for Deoxys struck them instead. The Oxus may have escaped, but it seems I've reaped in an even bigger reward. <laughs> uh, why do you have to laugh like- OH! OH! Oh man, that girl- that, that lady has Medusa eyes! Well done indeed. Goodbye forever, my dear Pokédex owners. What happened to us? N no This can't be! Professor Oak- Oh, Professor Oak's here? Where is he? Lorelei, please. We can't let Blue's parents see him like this. We need to contact Bill quickly. Ah, so there's a way to cure us, huh? Uh, what's going on? Prologue. Ten years ago. Whoa, we're going way back. So the story of this is uh, might actually have some potential, but that remains to be seen. So, yeah, hopefully it does. Okay, just one more attack to get its HP bar into the red. Wait, what? The wild Articuno has fled. <laughs> you telling me that the game of Pokemon actually exists in this world? That is so meta. What? What? Oh, hey. Hi, Mom. Young man, put that controller down and go play outside. But I'm so close to catching all 150 Pokemon in the game. <laughs> yeah, I gotta catch them all. No buts, young man. Go inside and get some fresh air. Yes, Mom. Yeah, it would make sense that playing a game in this world may uh, make it seem possible to catch all the Pokemon in the world because it's a game because it will require a lot more time, a lot more training, you're much more prone to error than in the games where the games basically make you an all-powerful uh, protagonist, not like this. I hate it when she calls me young man. I have a name. My name is, yeah, we already know what our name is. Alright, our name is actually normally Red, but for the purposes of this playthrough, I'm going to go by my own name, so... Yeah, Ornus, enter the adventure. Let's do this. And before anything else, let's fix up some settings here. I want the battle stop to be set to make it some a little bit harder. And I guess that's it, really. Uh, I wonder what our trainer card looks like. Oh, it looks pretty good. And do we have anything in our bag? Oh, no, wait. No, no, dude. Not now. Let's see if we have anything in our bag. Oh wow, I like the like format of the bag too because it's not like the boring uh, Gen 3 format where they had like five or six different uh, spaces for items. It's more like the Gen uh, 5 format, like in black and white, which looks awesome too. I like it. But before anything else, actually, let me just address the issue of this because in case you haven't noticed, our time is stuck on like 12 uh, midnight or midday I guess because when I downloaded this game it did mention that it would have this bug so I'm just gonna do some troubleshooting and I'll be right back let me just save first what? why would the save? what? why would it save? There's a Pokemon on TV. It looks like I'm having fun. Yeah, it's having fun. I'm not. I mean, why the hell won't my game save? Yeah, I want to save. 
Exchange the backup memory? What the hell? Alright, after some exhausting <laughs> trial and error. Oh, wait. Shit, the volume. The volume is too loud. Uh... There we go. Can you hear me? Can you hear me now? Alright, good. Better, alright. So, after some exhausting trial and error, I finally managed to fix it. It took me quite a while too. I had to download a new emulator because it turns out the one I was using was outdated. So, I guess just goes to show you how smart I am, huh? Alright, um, let me just fix up the options a little bit more before we start. Because... Since the emulator is new, all the changes that I made earlier were all for naught. I, I pressed B. I wonder if it still works. Yeah, it still works. Okay. And yeah. Without, let's start this. It's also a little blurry than earlier. Why is that? I wonder if that's in the settings too. I probably fucked something up. Ah, there we go. Much more clear. Alright, so now let's start this game in earnest. Uh, yeah, this is my bed. That's where I slept. There's a Pokemon on TV. It looks like I'm having fun. Yeah, I sure had fun moving all those options around. This is not the time for Minecraft. <laughs> Minecraft exists in this world? Ah, do you want to use the, the glitch cleaner? What? Does this clean the game? That, that probably is going to come in handy. I'm going to remember that. Hmm, I've just noticed that all my clothes are red. Gee, I wonder why. Could I possibly be the protagonist of some manga? Who knows? It's crammed full of Pokemon books. Yeah, the usual. Let's go downstairs and see what... Wait, where the fuck did mom go? What the hell? She just leaves a 10-year-old boy inside the house? I, at least that's assuming uh, I'm 10 years old. I don't really know how old I am. Nice and made dresser, yeah, pretty normal. Let's head outside then. And it's night. It's midnight since I fixed the clock. Akai's house. Is that is that my dad? Like my dad who ran out on, a, on us? Because I saw my mom's name and that was definitely not her name. <laughs> Oaks residence. Yeah, let's go in. Let, there looks like no one is home. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's. I think that they're home, but the door is probably locked because you know it's freaking midnight. Ketchum's right. Why Ash is here? Is Ash in this game? Whoa! Mela, I'm so sorry about Pete. I can't imagine what you are going through right now. Del oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, yep. You see, that's a staple in the Pokemon world for any of you. Pound Town, the tranquil setting of peace and purity. Yeah, without any fathers for some reason. That's sort of a, a like stereotype in the Pokemon world where... Kids always do not have dads, or if they do have dads, they always walk out on them. I have no idea why it's like that, but it's just how it is, I guess, in this world. It's actually quite dark, if you think about it. I'm waiting for mom and papa. What's your name? It's Orin. What's yours? Also, I like the fact that our protagonist in this game is for once not the silent character a la Undertale. Because in most Pokemon games, it's like that, but in this one, our character actually has dialogue, which is pretty nice. My name is... Actually, Mom and Papa told me to never give strangers my name. Ah, uh, yeah, fair enough. But why are you waiting for them in a Pokemon Center at midnight? I think... I think I have to call Child Protective Services. If they even exist in this world. Who kn because with so many absentee fathers, I doubt that they still do. Looks like no one is home. Yeah, it's for sale. Smartass. Alright. I really want to run, but I can't. Also, I just realized that our mom told us to get out of the house. A young kid at 12 o'clock midnight. <laughs> ah, man. What great timing for me to start this quest. Professor Oak's Laboratory. And you two, what are you two doing up at 12? Professor Oak, good luck in your training with Master Chuck, okay? Eat properly and make sure you wear a sweater when it's cold. Yeah, and... Master Chuck's like a martial artist in this world. I'll be fine, Gramps. So, Blue's going to train under a uh, martial arts Pokemon trainer, which is nice. And also, man, Professor Oak is a lot younger. I mean, I'm used to seeing him as an old person, so 
this is kind of shaking things up, alright? So, I don't really have any place to go because the only other place is heading out to town and I don't really have a Pokemon yet, so maybe you'd like to come with me? Polly! Huh? Polly! Oh no, it's sad! Are, are you scared? Polly, oh no. It's alright, little fella. I won't hurt you. Polly, Polly, yeah! <laughs> Looks like we got ourselves a new friend! Goodbye, Gramps. Yeah, looks like he's off to training, and that little girl, who I actually think is green now, like one of the main characters. Mama, Papa, where are you? What's going on? Huh? M Mama? Papa? Where are you? Oh. Oh, that can't be good. Ah, uh, that, that is no bueno. Okay. What's going on? What happened? Why did the game hang? End of prologue. Oh, thank god. <laughs> that actually scared me. <laughs> I thought that there was another technical issue that I had to go back and change yet again. Oh man, I'm so glad. It's still working. Phantom Pokemon. I wonder what that is. Five years later. Okay, buddy, and it's still night. <laughs> of course, because I'm using uh, the real-time clock. Okay, buddy, we have officially signed up for the Indigo League. Soon we will be facing strong trainers all around Kanto. Polly, Polly, yeah, he seems pretty worried. <laughs> Don't worry, buddy. You guys can defeat anyone who dares to fight us. We're the best. Nice, confident attitude, but make sure that we don't become arrogant. Eek! What's going on? Hey, it's a Nidorino. Oh my Arceus! Just got inside the Pokeball already. Is she trying to catch it or something? <laughs> Come on, buddy. Let's help her out. Polly, Polly. Oh, all right. So we're gonna help her catch it then. Where are we, by the way? Is this a Pelt Town? Yeah, it is. Pelt Garden. Hey there, friend. Having a nice, uh, night, I guess, because it's still m night where I live. Hey, Oren, I think you should help Kelly with that Nidorino. Yeah, I, I am. I'm just going to see what the hell you guys are doing here. Sitting here doing nothing. I mean, are none of you trainers? I want to be a famous actress, but my agent told me that I look way too generic. Do I look generic to you? <laughs> um, telling an NPC she looks generic. Uh, you know what? Don't give a damn about your looks. Go for it, you know, if it makes me happy. You're a jerk! I hate- OH SHIT! NO! I PRESSED THIS! I'M SO SORRY! I AM SO SORRY! I DIDN'T MEAN TO- I DIDN'T MEAN TO SAY THAT! I JUST MISPRESSED! I SWEAR! You're a jerk! I HATE YOU! How dare you hurt a beautiful flower like me! I'm an individual, damn it! Oh, I'm so sorry! I didn't mean that! Oh! Oh, man. The first episode has been a disaster so far. Oops, I've just dropped my ball. Do you mind picking up my ball? Dude, you know how that sounds, right? Come on, they're on the floor! Yeah, I think you can pick up your own balls, man. Alright, let's do this! Need, need, need! Uh... Nothing happened? Oh, do we have to talk to the girl? Oh, Alright, here we go! Need, need, need! Yeah, need, need, need! Need to get your ass whooped! Why does it keep breaking out of the Pokeball? I give up! I give up! You have to weaken the Pokemon before you attempt to capture it. Dipshit. Can you please help me? Yeah, no problem. I don't think you have a Pokemon anyway, so... Yeah, this will be nothing. Wow, we have a Pokemon. Does that have a name? Uh, yeah, sure it does. My buddy's name is... Alright, so what should we name our frog friend here, huh? You know, I just watched a really funny video on YouTube a while back about this uh, Asian... Uh, Japanese, actually. A Japanese comedian who made a joke, and this was one of the names she made up for that joke. And I don't know, it kinda has a good ring to it, so that's what I'm gonna name our starter here. Jadeep, you're in my party now, let's do this! Alright, here we go! Jadeep or Yadi? Actually, I'm gonna call him Yadi because that sounds a lot cooler. Wally Arena appeared, let's do this, Yadeep! Alright, uh, you know what, it's night time, I think you should go to sleep. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, that didn't work. And... Our defense is down. Alright, so... You know what? Just like any good Pokemon fighter, I'm going to <laughs> just spam one move until the enemy is dead. Besides, the Ninorino might have poison points, so I don't want to risk getting poisoned, and you know. So, the fun thing about this emulator is that it actually has a speed up button, so I can just speed up any fight I'm in. So... That makes it a lot faster. Wait, we were holding a Cetrus Berry? Damn, I wasted that. I probably shouldn't have sped up, but eh. It's over now. 
and we level up. Also, it's kind of confusing why Pokemon, despite evolving, is only level 6, but hey. There we go! Oh my Arceus, you did it! Thank you, thank you! Let me repay you by healing your Pokemon. I'm going to play with my new Nidorino, thank you! Yeah, again, I wasted that citrus berry. Ah, uh, that sucks. What should we do now, buddy? Hmm, how about you find some trainers in the forest? At level 6? Yeah, right, I would grind a few levels first. Anyway, are you guys still gonna say the same generic lines you said earlier, or... Yup, still saying the same generic lines, okay. So, I actually want to check out the town first, before we go out, because... Uh, in case you guys didn't know, I'm sort of, I guess, semi-completionist uh, gamer. And I won't complete things 100%, but I, will, I do try to be as thorough uh, as possible when playing game. Like, I talk to everyone, I go everywhere, because... Uh, I just don't want to miss out on stuff yet. Hi, I'm Daisy. I have a unique appearance, but I'm only destined for small rules like giving you a map. Oh wait, I don't have a map. Ah oh, man, that's so sad. <laughs> she acknowledges that she's just a uh, like side character, even though she has a special sprite. That's that's sort of depressing, actually. I, I feel bad for her. I wish she has a bigger role in this game because she has her own sprite. You remind me of a friend. He's in a coma right now, and I really miss him. Wow, you know, so far... You'd expect Pokemon games to be lighthearted, but... <laughs> this... This first uh, few minutes of the game has been a lot of dark things. I mean, parents abandoning children, people in comas... So much going on in this place. What did you do to your poor Pokemon, Orin? How many times do I have to tell you not to overwork your Pokemon? Let your Pokemon rest for a while. I mean, yeah, thanks, I guess, but you didn't have to scream at me. Alright, young man, please be safe. Alright, see you later. Meow, meow. It's surprising to see a Pokemon not say their own name. Alright, so... You know, I should be going in here because it's still night. But I guess we should keep exploring. Let's... Oh. Fast forward it too fast. Alright. So, all the major cities in the Kanto region are named out for colors. That is so cool and exciting, right? I mean, yeah, whatever floats your boat, I guess. I mean, sure, it certainly makes our region unique. I wonder where Ash is. Oh, hi, Orin. Wow, you've grown so much. I'm just checking up on Delia. Between you and me, she's very close to her breaking point. The poor thing lost her husband and... Uh, oh! <laughs> Ash is dead! <laughs> Jesus, that's dark! What happened to him? Is he the guy in the coma? Dude! I'm surprised she could still keep a smile on her face. Wow, I... I feel so bad for you. I mean, condolences. Lots and lots of them. And she still has a smile. <laughs> Hello, Orin. Your mother has told me so much about you. I am Delia Ketchum, and it's lovely to meet you. Hello, Miss Ketchum. <laughs> Please, just call me Delia. Oh, I feel so sorry for her. <laughs> Jesus, this game is- or I actually should be saying Arceus. Arceus, this game is so dark! I mean, so much tragedy in this one town. We haven't even left Pallet Town yet! Bird type is my favorite Pokemon type. Bird type? There's no such thing. It's flying type. Yeah, it is. Oh my god, it's called bird type, you dude. We have a case of an entitled kid right here. So I'm just gonna walk away. I wonder if this house has been sold yet. Hey there, Granny. The family used to live in this house, but one day the daughter went missing. The heartbroken parents moved away because staying here just hurt them too much. I wonder what happened to that little girl. Could that little girl possibly be the girl that uh, we encountered a few years earlier? But the house that was here was still for sale back then. So, uh huh. I don't know. Anyway, let's talk to some more NPCs. I moved here from the Ore region. Compared to the Ore region, this place is literally a 5-star resort. The cults alone <laughs> in the Ore region, this reminds me of Pokemon Surgeons, makes you feel disgusted. I imagine that disgusted is probably the least of uh, the adjectives you could use to describe them in that place. My grandpa told me that there wasn't a Pokemon Center back in the old days. People would have to travel all the way to Viridian City just to get their Pokemon healed. A lot of Pokemon died between the distances from Palatine to Viridian City. Man, this game doesn't pull any punches, does it? Chansey! Oh yeah! So cute! Please make me forget about all the 
dark shit that I just witnessed in the past few minutes. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. Yeah, generic healing line. I don't really need healing yet, so no thank you. And it's raining. And Team Rocket! Ah! Watch it, you little maggot! S sorry! I'm looking for the Phantom Pokemon to get lost. Phantom Pokemon. That guy has Pokeballs on him. He must be a Pokemon trainer. And like an idiot, we're going to go fight him. Despite his uniform clearly stating that he's a member of a criminal gang. I really don't want to hurt a little kid, but we can't have anyone interfering with our plans. Oh wow, he just states it up front on losing Weir. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh no. Yep, I can hear it. I can hear it. I'm poisoned. Oh no, no! No! Ah shit, Yadip, come on, hold in there, Yadip. Yadip's poison. I'm just gonna fast forward to the Pokemon Center. Come on! Come on! I don't really need healing yet, so no thank you. Heal! Now! Please! Ah! Uh, thank you. Ah! Uh, don't we have any antidotes? Or anything? We do not have any antidotes. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. Ha! Alright, so... That's the crazy si Crazy scientist? What happened to Professor Oak? I thought that he was well respected. I better avoid it. What happened to Professor Oak? What happened to everyone in this town? Why is everything pain and suffering? Well, at this rate, if there are gonna be poison Pokemon everywhere by the rocket grunts, we are literally screwed. I mean, we can't afford to be poisoned a lot, especially since we don't have any potions or any items right now. Also, can we save the game now? I wonder if we can. You know what? I'm gonna try. Yeah, come on. Please tell me that it can save. Ah, oh, fuck. I still can't save. Because I'm gonna have to rely on save states then. And we're going to go up against these guys without any item at all. Sorry, kid. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. Yeah, wrong time, definitely. Being that there is no Pokemon in town and that I don't have any items. So I'm gonna have a bad time. I'm gonna have to rely on my bubble. If I don't want to get poisoned. Please don't use poison sting! Thank god, it keeps missing. Alright, get wrecked! That's one down. Alright, come at me. What else do you have? Oh, a sand troop. Oh. Well. This is gonna be overkill. Yep. Lucky for us, we gain levels like a boss. Yadip must have a really, really good EXP rate. I need backup! Reporting backup! Oh, that's not good! Need to go double time. Get lost, you stupid kid. You don't know who you're messing in. Yeah, that's true. Because I literally have no idea who you guys are. Maybe uh, Team Rocket just isn't uh, w more well-known at this time. So, let's go up here. What? Is that Mew? Huh? I could have sworn there was something behind me. Yeah, it is! It's Mew! What is that Pokemon? Could that be the Phantom Pokemon? Uh, Mew is a legendary, I know that much, but Phantom is pushing it too far, don't you think? No! No, wait! <laughs> Knowing us, we were probably trying to catch it. <laughs> Where did it go? So now we're searching for the Phantom Pokemon. Hey there, friend. Have you seen a Pokemon here by any chance? Hmm. There's no sign of the Phantom Pokemon here. H hey! You're not part of us! And, huh. I actually am surprised that he didn't try to battle us. Alright, so. We're getting deeper into the forest alone with no items. Oh yeah, we heard it again. Alright, what's happening? Hey, it's blue! Damn it! Someone beat me to it! Dude. I don't think that a simple Charmander would be enough against a freaking Mew. What are you doing? You almost had it! Out of my way, it's my turn! Yep, we're trying to catch it. <laughs> yeah, Boo's like, oh, suit yourself. <laughs> he knows how powerful this thing is. He's just gonna let us have it. Alright, our best chance if we can put it to sleep. Alright, alright! We might actually be able to catch it! Shit! Alright, I'm gonna just... Put on a save state right here because I really want to catch this thing. Let me save it. Alright, save state one. Yeah, we have a save state. Alright, good. Alright, now be careful, you deep. Don't make it faint, alright? Just 
a tiny little nudge. Just enough to get its HP into the red. Uh, oh, that's good. Alright. Oh shit, it woke up! Alright, you know what? I don't think it'll run. So I'm just gonna keep on spamming bubble. What? Okay, forget that. I guess I'm gonna spam pound. Alright, alright, that's enough! That's enough! We have water absorbed, that's cool, but that's enough! Alright! Now, hypnosis, make it sleep! No! Ah, shit! It just pulled the no you on me! Shit! Do we even have a Pokeball? We don't even have a Pokeball! Why are we even trying to catch this thing? You know what? I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna make you faint. Because I've had enough of you. Oh yeah, it has... I guess it absorbed our ability as well. Come on, just... Just kill it. We got it! Oh! Oh, never mind. I thought that we won, but I guess story-wise we didn't. <laughs> uh, it had fun uh, wrecking us. Couldn't you tell from the battle I just had that it was stronger than me? That is why I called back my Charmander. I... I lost? Yeah, no shit. You have to know your limitations. Otherwise, you're only beating yourself. Wow. That's really surprising because... I thought that I know you to be a douchebag. So this is a very, very different blue. I can't believe I lost. And the Phantom Pokemon chapter. Chapter 2, Missing Pokemon. Alright. So, as much as I, want, as I want to continue, that, uh, like, technical stuff that I did at the start of this episode ate almost all the time that I had. And it's pretty late here where I live. It's actually almost midnight, so I probably should be packing up for the day, hitting the hay. So... That's it for this episode. If you liked what you saw, leave a like and be sure to subscribe if you want to see more because I'm definitely going to be playing more of this game, this awesome, beautiful game. And farewell for now, guys.